Greetings, Traveler Paimon and Lisa. Sucrose! It's been a while since the last time we saw you! On the way here, I overheard quite a few people talking about alchemical potions. At first, I was worried something might have gone wrong with the herbs. But judging by the way people were talking, it seems like they were pretty pleased with the results. <laughs> Sucrose, your bioalchemical expertise was exactly what we needed for potion making. Yeah, we've been able to make potions with all sorts of different effects! You mastered potion making in such a short amount of time? I guess that's expected for someone of your talent, Traveler. I wouldn't be surprised if you became a potion master one day. Still, if you manage to master potion making in such a short amount of time, we should be able to start teaching the public about it as well. Wait, was that also a part of Jean's plan? Yep, it's something she and Mr. Albedo talked about. As I understand it, the goal was not just to create and sell potions, but also to teach the principles and practices of alchemy to the people. Thanks to your shop, the public's understanding of alchemical potions has increased quite a bit. Perhaps, one day, they'll even be able to make simple potions themselves. Hmm... Without the proper training, though, those potions could be dangerous to use. You're right. With Lisa there to mentor you, Traveler, we could rest assured that nothing would go wrong during the potion-making process. However, when it comes to the general public, we have to think of a way to ensure that any resulting potions would be safe to use. So, Mr. Albedo is planning to establish a set of criteria to evaluate various levels of potion-making ability. People will have to pass the exam that corresponds to their level of proficiency before being allowed to brew their own potions. Let me guess. You would like us to also take part in this exam? Yes. Although it would probably be more accurate to say that we would like you to help us finalize the contents of the exam. In order to ensure a proper level of difficulty, we need to first collect the relevant data. That's where our mock exam comes in. If you could take it, Traveler, your results would serve as a very important reference for us. You will, of course, be compensated for your efforts. <laughs> what a great idea. I must admit, I'm very interested to see how much my cutie's alchemy skills have improved. <laughs> Confidence is a good look on you, cutie. Wonderful. Then, let me explain a little bit about how the exam works. The exam has four levels. Beginner, Intermediate, Advanced, and Expert. To pass, all you need to do is brew a potion within the time limit that satisfies the main objective. Satisfying additional objectives will earn you extra rewards. Okay, all of this is starting to sound pretty official. Paimon's nervous all of a sudden. Just do what you normally do and you should be fine. If you don't pass the first time around, you can always retake the exam. So, no need to put too much pressure on yourselves. Oh, retakes are allowed! Whew, that's a relief. 